Hello belligerents. Welcome to the turtle wax follow-up video for the rubbing compound. As you can see, the car is still here. So it's actually been well over a month since I uh, did the video. I shot the video and uh, you can still see residue everywhere because I did not do a good job applying the product. Not at all. I started noticing this stuff about a week after. You know, the car maybe got driven like three or four times during the entire period of time that, you know, between the shoot and now. As, as of right now, this car really isn't something I want to drive. I'm trying to get my other Integra running. But as you can see, like, it's been at least five weeks. And the parts where the Turtle Wax really did a significant job bringing the paint back, there it still looks pretty good. You know, this stuff, you get about a month of your paint not looking terrible with this product at the very least. And uh, you can still see the other parts where we did a really, really bad job. Just, it, it was significant improvement on the first few days and then it started doing this. What you have to do is you have to make sure you wipe the product off. And what happened was, after uh, Todd left, I was running out of daylight, it was getting cold, I was going to go eat out with my family... And I was just running out of time, so I half-assed it. And I paid. I don't think it's damaged anything as far as the paint is concerned. But um, if you use this product, it does work, and you need to give it at least a day. Don't start at noon. Start early. And you have to work on it all day to get it right. But if you do get it right, the parts where it, I did get it right, like this door here, God, that still looks, that still looks phenomenal. So... You have to you have to do this product right, or it will bite back and make your car look really dingy. Anyways, that's the update of the Turtle Wax compound. It concludes the mystery.